friends, I'm one of the friends, and I am Emily Lampa, one of the newest hosts here at HSN. So thank you so much for being with us this morning. We're so excited, and I am particularly excited because in just a bit, we're gonna be talking about one of my obsessions, plants. Okay, we're gonna get to that in a bit, but I just wanted to make sure that we were saying hello to our friends on Facebook. Hi, Kathleen, hi, Dawn, hi, Miguel, hi, Annie, hi, so many people. Oh my goodness, lots and lots of our friends. But we have um, a long show ahead, so I wanted to make sure that we were at least saying hello to some of our friends right off the top of this uh, coming back from break. But let's talk about those plants, shall we? Oh my goodness, it is one of those times a year when it's cold outside and we get locked in our homes and we're thinking about, of course, the air that we're breathing, the companionship that we have, and I don't know about you, but I think of plants as my babies. If you're not 100% about the plant life yet, I'm sure you will be as we come closer to spring because everyone starts to get a little bit more excited about getting their hands dirty. And if you're looking at a simple way to get started, this is definitely it. It's from Leaf and Petal. It's a one piece pearls and jade pothos with a planter. So you're not just getting the plant, you're getting the planter too. So literally when you open the box from Leaf and Petal, you are getting a ready to display plant and eventually it will grow up to look like that plant over there. I, I, I think we can get a shot. Do you see this? It is gorgeous. I had to reach over and touch it because I didn't believe that it was real because it is gorgeous and full and luscious and see how it drapes and is, it's just wonderful. We love our relationship with our friends at Leaf and Petal because they know how to send you quality live plants via mail. I know you're thinking to yourself, is that even possible? But we have our friend Rosie Anthony standing by on Skype to give us all the details on how you can unpack your best new friend. Rosie, we're so glad to have you. Rosie is an interior I'm designer, but she specializes in plants, and she always has great ideas on making your space more livable and lively with your plant friends. Rosie. Hi. Hi, uh, hi, hi. hi. I'm so How's excited. everybody doing? I'm so, I'm so happy to be back. I'm so happy to be here with you. Yes. Oh, and I, so, I yes. should mention really quickly before you could get into the um, whole leaf and petal, um, we wanted to make sure that you knew that you could get the planter in two different colors. So it comes in the black and it comes in the mint. All right, take it away. Take it away, girl. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's go. Let's do it. Let's get into it. So, yes, like you said, you can get both colors. So you can go into the lighter side or maybe something in the darker side. Both sides, both colors are going to work with just about any palette. What's absolutely beautiful about this plant, it's, it's maintenance in my opinion. This thing doesn't need water for maybe 9 to 12 days. Awesome. And the best way, yes. And so low maintenance, it's beautiful. Like you said, it's dramatic. I want to show you the one that I have back here. It's equally as dramatic as the big one you have there. But look at this. This is just a few months of growth. And it's just so big and beautiful and lush. And I love it so much. So you're going to get this like so but in a few months you'll have this dramatic cascading effect you can choose any color you like the best way to water this and i just want to mention this because this is really important when it is time to water it you know always check the soil with your finger if it feels dry go ahead and water it if it feels moist still leave it alone until the next time but take it out of its pot out of the ceramic pot leave it in its grower's pot take it straight to the sink, water it, let the water run right through it and bring it right back to its ceramic pot because guess what? We took all the guesswork out. It has a saucer that's gonna catch any excess water. So there, instant gratification. Oh my goodness, you are absolutely right about that. Being that, you know, there are a lot of folks who really picked up on the plant craze during the lockdown. Yeah. They thought, I need a little yeah. bit of something in my house because I'm not getting out a lot. And maybe some folks are already obsessed, but some are just getting into it, but they're a little frightened about maintenance. Like you said, this is a low maintenance plant, but this literally comes how it comes, correct? I mean, this is what you're correct. getting. You're getting the plant. It's got its own little planter on the inside, but then you put it in this gorgeous ceramic, really well well-made ceramic saucer and pot. So you're Isn't really getting, really when you think about it, $30 to get the plant, a live plant that's already thriving as well as the saucer and the pot. That is really just a wonderful deal. 
It sure is. And I mean, and that's always the goal. Our goal is to always, when we're out there hunting for plants, think of us as your designers, your horticulturists, your growers. We're looking for quality plants that are not only unique in the way they look, they have to perform really well and they have to be low maintenance. That's one of like the highest points. Our points when we're looking out there is low maintenance plants that are still very unique, interested and beautiful. We don't want just like any ratty plant that's going to survive. You still want it to be beautiful. And we're always going to give you that customer service because we encourage include this little pamphlet. I'm not sure if you have a copy there. And it tells you everything to do. But like I said, this plant is so low maintenance. The pothos is actually one of the first plants that I started with. Believe it or not, I once had what I call the black thumb. I didn't have a green thumb. And this was one of my starter plants. And after like a week of not watering it and it looking just as beautiful, I started to take interest and notice, oh my God, this plant is low maintenance. And it Barely, I do anything. I can almost confidently say it's indestructible. <laughs> and I do love that you're showing what the plant looks like in just a couple of months, because that's really what I would have asked if I were like completely yeah. new to owning plants. How, what will it look like? How will it grow? And I really, like I said, I had to go and touch some of these plants that have grown quite a bit because I said, oh my gosh, I can't believe how gorgeous they look. They can't be real, but they are. They are so vibrant, so lush. And so knowing that, you know, you're going to put your effort into it, again, very low maintenance if you're very new at this, but it is a plant that's going to give back to you. And Leaf and Petal really thinks about everybody when it comes to what they're sending out. They give you the information that you're going to need. As Rosie pointed out, you're going to get the beautiful plants. You're going to get this planter, again, ready to display, ready to take care of, ready to love. And they specialize in sending live plants. And the Leaf and Petal team, they stand by the quality of their product. Isn't that right, Rosie? Oh yeah, oh yeah, we stand by it. All of our plant plants have warranty, so why not? Why not take a leap of faith if you are new to the plant world and you're a little bit intimidated Try it. I'm telling you, this is the way to go. The pothos plant, it is so low maintenance. It's going to also give you extra babies. Let's get into that. As the plant grows and you become more and more knowledgeable about plants, as you get to take care of this beautiful plant, you can do what they call propagate and cut the extra you know, and then just start a new plant, baby. You put it right in soil or water and guess what? Now you got two plants. I mean, this plant, there's so much to talk about it because it's so versatile and it's easy and it looks beautiful and it looks intimidating. And that's what's exciting about it is that it's so easy. And then it's got this beautiful variegation that you just, you don't see in just any pothos. No. And so that's what's really unique about it. I love it, I love it, I can't talk about it enough. I am so glad you were talking about propagating your plant, making new plants out of your mommy plant, making little plant babies, because that is actually something we're gonna be talking about quite a bit, you and I, Rosie, over the next several weeks, because there's something starting very soon. Tina joined me because she's so excited to talk about it. Oh okay, my are gosh. you guys ready for the big Thank you so much, Rosie. Well, Rosie will be a part of it. A yep. big announcement for Emily Lampa. Ready? I don't want to steal your thunder. Get it, girl. Oh, it's okay. If you were to announce it, it just nope. means so much more to me. But there is a new show that's premiering on Monday, February 5th. That's next Monday. It is called Blooming Brilliant Gardens with Emily. And what I'm doing right there is actually opening the live plants that I got from Leaf and Petal so that I can show you what it's like to get these plants home. And you can see my little garden helpers there, my dogs. Render and Ray. <laughs> They're in all the videos because they love to be outside with me while I'm planting. And it's just, it's like amazing. It's like Christmas to be able to take home this, these beautiful plant babies. So I really do hope that you're gonna join us and have a great time like I do. I love getting my hands dirty and I hope you pick this up as a hobby if you haven't already. All right, 9 a.m. 9 a.m. Mondays. Yep. Emily, is it one hour? It is one hour. It'll be right after HSN Today. Yep. You'll follow right after, so just all, all of our friends follow over. The, okay, sometimes, right, like, you're like, does, does she really plant? Tell them what kind of farm you own. Um, I own a worm farm. <laughs> yes, we all heard the same thing. Yes, but I should explain. No, 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 just leave it just like that. Just, just leave it like that? Yeah, yeah. And no. make sure that they tune no. in on Monday to and find out why. And why she has a worm farm. Yes. I love gardening. So everything you need for gardening, <laughs> live plants, um, tools that you need, yes. everything. Um, if you go right now, you can 
kind of, you know, see what's going on. Yeah, and uh, one thing that we did want to mention also, because we are getting into the gardening season, aside from watching, we wanted to let you know that no matter what you end up buying with us, there is, it's 550 standard shipping across the board for the entire live plants purchase. So you don't even have to wait until the show, you can actually get it home yeah. and then in the meantime, while you're waiting for it to arrive, we'll tell you how to unpack it, yeah, everything yeah. that you need to know so that you can be successful with your new plant babies. Everybody, can we get a big round of applause Yay! in the studio? Uh, can I clap too? Yay! <laughs> so Everybody, excited. anybody? Somebody clap they're, with they're me. They're all very busy. They're very busy they're very preparing busy. for the next thing. They've got it. Yes. So Congratulations. Thank you. thank you, my friend. I appreciate that. You want to take the... the yeah. uh,